छः फरवरी को सवेरे चार बजकर सत्तर मिनट पर तुर्की के गाजीन टेप शहर से चौंतीस किलोमीटर पश्चिम में सात पॉइंट आठ मैग्नीट्यूड का भूकंप आया भूकंप के बाद सत्तर से अधिक झटके महसूस किए गए तुर्की में अब तक तेरह हजार और सीरिया में पैंतीस सौ लोगों की मौत पैंसठ हजार घायल होने की आशंका है Well, I can feel the situation. People are going through there because I have experienced the earthquake like that in Nepal in 2015. It was also devastating. Okay, now let's listen what WHO has said on this. So far. It's estimated that more than 4,000 people have been killed, and more than 18,700 are injured. But we all know that these numbers will continue to rise as the situation evolves. What these numbers don't tell us is the grief and loss. Being experienced by families right now, every hour that passes, the chances of finding survivors alive diminishes. Continued aftershocks, severe winter conditions, damage to roads, power supplies, communications, and other infrastructure continue to hamper access and other search and rescue efforts. National officials in both countries. Are leading search and rescue operations, while anticipating the increased need for trauma care to treat the injured. Damage mapping is ongoing to understand where we need to focus our attention. We are mobilizing emergency supplies, and we have activated WHO's network of emergency medical teams to provide essential healthcare for the injured and.